TV. Yeah, they got Brock Purdy. But do you take Brock Purdy or Shadur Sanders? What would you take? What would you do? What would you take if you had the opportunity to get Shadur Sanders or Brock Purdy? Let me know. Shadur would end up in Tampa or Miami. I don't think so. Tampa got Baker Mayfield, who's been doing well. They're not going to lose enough games next year. Neither is uh, Miami, nor are the Jets, because Aaron Rodgers is coming back next year, right? Imagine the Jets with Sauce Gardner. And I don't know their other cornerbacks, so I don't want to be disrespectful. He might be good. But imagine him with Sauce Gardner and Travis Hunter. Goodness gracious. Travis and Sauce? The cornerback duo, Sauce and T. Sauce and T. Sauce and T. Okay. Sauce and T. Shiloh is going to be great in the NFL. Looking at the field of safeties during the playoff, nobody was really busting grapes. You feel me? Shout out to B, uh, BM, Bridget Maxey. You feel me? That's what I've been saying. Look at the games. Shiloh is an NFL safety, man. Come on. Shadur would be a perfect fit with the Raiders. Oh, that would be that would be a nice fit, too. Coach AP, Shadur in Las Vegas? Either way it go, I want Shadur and Shiloh to be together. And Las Vegas is not too far from Colorado. Coach Prime and them, they can get their back and forth easy. Bucky can get their back and forth easy. But Denver is my – all right, let's go. Top three picks. Let's say top five picks before we get up out of here on, on this subject. Top five picks as far as destinations for Shadur Sanders and Shiloh Sanders next year. Top five picks as for NFL destinations – with Shiloh and Shadur, regardless of what they have going on right now, quarterback play, whatever, what would be the ideal team location, fit, brand, um, you know, partnership? What would be the ideal location? My picks would be, as far as top three now, I'm going to go five. I'm going to go five, all right? My five places would be in no particular order, but... Atlanta, Denver, Las Vegas, Dallas. Oh, I got to think about the fifth one. Atlanta, Las Vegas, Denver, Dallas. It was one more. Y'all put it out there. Say Chicago. No, not Chicago. Um, L.A. with Harbaugh, where the Chargers got Hubert. Um, San Francisco. Uh, uh, I think those top four right there. That might be. That might be it. That might be it. Let me know what y'all think. Seahawks, ah, uh, and beat Geno back up, man. <laughs> Mister Seven, there he go. Raiders, 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 and more Raiders. Commanders. Oh, I would hate to see him in Washington D.C. with the Commanders. Sorry, Frank. I would hate to see him with the commander. I don't like the commander. I think they need to change that damn name and uniforms. It looks so little boyish. Don't it look like the little league team of the NFL? <laughs> They're the little league team of the NFL. Commanders, Cowboys, Falcons, Bills. Okay. Green Bay. Uh, nah, I can't see it, though. Shout out to Jordan Love. I know we said regardless of their quarterback situation, but Green Bay. Uh, no, nah, I don't think he want to go up there, especially even cultural wise. You know, you go to the Raiders and get beat by Mahomes every year. <laughs> the only thing I want teams to do is not make Travis a system player. Yeah, let him be him. Right, right. I would like for him to go somewhere where he's comfortable too. Even though New York would be great fit on the field, I don't know if it'll be great fit for Travis and his lifestyle. Atlanta possibly would be good for Travis. A place like Jacksonville, Travis, um, Kansas City, uh, what else? Arizona, o uh, I was about to say Oakland, Las Vegas. You know, I don't even think Las Vegas would be perfect ideal for Trav. Travis would be perfect for the Bears. Nah. Atlanta is the place for Travis. Um or for all three, I think. I think Travis would be great in a dome. Tampa Bay would be good for Travis. Yep. Don't go to Buffalo. <laughs> Shouts out to the Buffalo Bills, my, my my little league, my favorite team at, coming up as a kid. 
Dallas will have to trade up to get Shador. That's what we've been saying earlier. Uh, they will have to trade Dak, some picks, and possibly another player to get up that high to get Shador Sanders. Oh, man. Yeah, we're not worried about that right here. So that's that's the NFL 2025 NFL prospects from college football as this list was put out. And I'm just surprised that Travis was four behind Campbell and Nolan. Shouts out to them. Great players. But I think they just did this on this on this list. So they wouldn't put two CU people back, back, back to back. You know what I'm saying? Raiders got the picks. Raiders got the picks. Okay, to move up. All right. We're going to see what they do this year then. See how far... Are they how far um how much success they have to where they put them down lower in the draft? The lower they are, the harder it'll be to trade up. You know, if they get in these top five and then they try to trade up to number one by adding on another first or second round pick, either in the same year or following years, then yeah. Raiders got the picks, baby. Let's go, Raiders. Bears is the perfect place for Trav to play both ways. Ah. Why in that cold though? I want Trav to be in a tropical place. Somewhere in Florida, Texas, Atlanta, you know, I want him to be uh, in a place where the weather is not a factor where he could really do his thing. Hope he don't end up somewhere like Minnesota. AFC West is owned by the Chiefs. They need all help they can get. AFC West, the Chiefs are dominating, man. They better hope Andy Reid dip out and retire. I don't think he will. I think Andy Reid is at a point where he's like, man, I hate I'm this old. I wish I could have had more years with Mahomes. If I was younger, I'd stay with Mahomes forever. I think Trav, uh, Coach Andy Reid is thinking, you know. So yeah, this was Coach Prime posted. Shouts out to him, Mac Main, Young Money, Nt. I think Lil Wayne need to perform also. But yeah, that's what I wanted to bring up. Dang, it's been an hour already. Andy ain't going nowhere. Antonio Pierce is watching for Sanders boys. I would be too. And it would be perfect in that all uh, black and silver, silver and black. Big dog, what about New Orleans or Atlanta if fields don't go? Follow prime. Fields, fields would be good in New Orleans too. I think New Orleans about to give up on Jameis Winston, and that'll be a mistake. I know that's gonna be controversial <laughs> to say. I love Jameis Winston, though. I think Jameis is is a is a is a is a big time player, man. He's a star, he's gonna win a Super Bowl in this league. Watch. Chico crazy. They said he's Chico said Jameis Winston is gonna win the Super Bowl. Yes, I said it. Watch. Eat them dubs. Eat them dubs, baby. Let me see what y'all said about that comment when I said Jameis Winston gonna win the Super Bowl. 